That was pretty. Jesse needs gear on the outside, arm outstretched, desperate for the tag. He knows his partner, the man he saved earlier on from a beating between the electric fang. He's on his last legs. Jesse needs gear, really needs to get into this match. What are now, we going to see Lumpy's now? Learning. Lumpy's learning now. Look at that face. Oh, oh splash. Lumpy falls to the floor. I'm not sure if he meant to get out of that or if he just fell down. Uh, I think maybe that would look. Oh, eight minutes gone in this match. An electric fang. They've dominated the majority of it, although got to give it to Lumpy Magoo. He's managed to get a few moves in. Well, if Lumpy was ex as smart as Professor, he would have just put a submission hold and maybe got it done. Oh, Fang dropping the foot to the midsection of Lumpy Magoo after a vicious snapmare takedown. Oh, Lumpy manages to reverse the Irish whip into the corner turnbuckles, but, but still not smart enough to get up for the tag. Oh, fine. could not do it. Little Fang. Oh, look, Jesse Newsgear once again distracting the referee. It's causing his partner to get beat down at the hands of Electric Fang. Cover. Oh, no. Lumpy's partner, Jesse, really needs to look at what he's doing. As I heard in a cool song, uh, you need to know when to hold him and know when to fold him. That goes with wrestling, too. Is that a song about cards? It's a good song. That's all that matters. I like songs. Yeah, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of the musicals. Oh, look at the way that uh, Electrico is uh, just dangling. I've also oh. heard that Electrico likes some musicals as well. Really? I think that may have been where he got his name. Not sure. He's really just taunting him. Oh, no, no. He's just taking him down. When he's not when he's not doing the musicals, he can still get vicious like that. And distracting the referee one more time. Double slap there, takedown. And they're laying in their boots. Ten minutes gone, twenty minutes remaining. Oh, we've got to cover. Oh, referee Bill Clark. Some of the greatest officials here in the rest of the world today. Oh, that's so unfair. Jesse distracts the ref and he doesn't see the beautiful tag that they make. I, I, I must admit, even I missed Just that like that. Just oh, like that. Hey, what? Well, they're the electric fang. They're fast. Right? They're so fast, you even miss things like the tag. I don't miss anything. Oh! Kick to the kidneys of Lumpy Magoo. Bill Clark may have missed it. The fans may have missed it. You may have missed it. But I saw it happen. Cover. Oh. That looked like a slow count to me then. Although, who am I to say a bad word against a DCW Zebra? Electrico. Oh, head into the turnbuckles for Lumpy Magoo. And uh, he's definitely going to be Lumpy at the end of tonight, Ashley. Lumpy's looking dazed here. I don't know uh, how much more he can take. Lumpy to the corner turnbuckle. This may be Lumpy's last match, I can tell you that. Oh, he reverses it. Oh, Lumpy finds the ability to reverse it from somewhere. Oh, look at those red boots shining like a beacon. A distress beacon at this point. Kind of looks like Ronald McDonald with those shoes. Jesse needs gear, really needs to get into this match. Lumpy Magoo certainly can't take much more of a beating here tonight at the team of the Electric Fang. Hey, well, they're working as a team. You see them right here. Oh, superb suplex. The this is a suplex. contest, and that's what it's about, you know? Taking out the other team, doing teamwork to get it done. Oh, look at little Fang. He's taunting Lumpy Magoo right in front of the cameraman. Cover! Oh, two count. We've seen some action here tonight at DCW Beach Blast. What a DVD this is in your collection. Some of the greatest DVDs of all time. Well, if, uh, we do have to look back, though. And DVD. Lumpy did say that um, 
they were wearing Halloween costumes, so. Did you just cut me off to tell me that? Yeah, sorry, sorry, Twink. Are you talking? Do you think you are a millionaire? Go ahead, go ahead. We're talking about. Uh, oh yeah, you are a millionaire, tonight, aren't you? Tonight, uh, yeah. Anyways, Twink. you can cut me off as long as I get the invites to the to the frat parties. We'll be fine. How much are you worth? Like ten dollars? Me? Go ahead. Say what you're gonna say. I've forgotten that. But look at the way Electrico choking down on Lumpy on the outside. Oh, and Fang coming in with kicks. Oh. Where has this mean streak come from, from Fang? Get the power on Fang! Yes. He's been eating his greens. That That's was awesome. The devastating scoop slam. There it is. Hubba. Oh. oh. Lumpy is not done. Lumpy, is he going to find that the energy from somewhere? We're going to see him hulk up. Oh, I'd, I'd love to see Lumpy McGew just rip that shirt off and underneath you see a superhero t-shirt yes, or something. Yes, you are definitely living in a comic book right now because that's never going to happen. No, no, no. Maybe it's just a dream. Fang calling for a body slam. I'm ready to see it. Wow. Definitely a slam. Textbook right there. Great double team action on the part. Of the electric fang. Good job, Jesse Mercer is, was there. What is this? To break up that cover. Jesse needs gear. Oh, uh, once again, distracting the referee. And this has really gotten out of hand quickly. Well, like we said, Jesse only had his first OVW match last night in his hometown of Campbellsville, Kentucky. So, uh, some inexperience on the part of Jesse needs gear here tonight. This is really starting to escalate. And it's costing Lumpy Magoo. I like it. Dearly here tonight. <laughs> Twink, you're worth about $10, so how about you put that $10 on the line and make a bet that uh, Lumpy Magoo loses? Oh, probably a worthy bet. He's getting choked out right now, thanks to the legs of Electrico. <laughs> 15 minutes gone, 15 minutes remaining. These guys are just playing it smart, you know. They're, uh, they're taking advantage when they can and... <laughs> <laughs> Getting the job done when it needs to be. Nice legal tag. It comes Electrico. I think we're going to see some more double team action now. And oh, Lumpy McGee's back just thrown into that turnbuckle with reckless abandon. This match surely can't go on for much longer. Now the fans here at the Davis Arena here tonight for DCW Beach Blast are enjoying this contest. Man, I'm really starting to feel sorry for Lumpy Magoo. Wait a second. No, I'm not. No, you're not. <laughs> this is awesome. I know. Big suplex. Oh! Whoa. Didn't get the oh. all of it. Oh. Didn't get the all of it. Here comes Jesse. Oh, Jesse stalling. But he's taking the fight to the Electrico. Oh, wow. And Fang. Baiting him in. Oh. Scoop and a slam. Jesse with almost some nonchalance in there tonight. He's been out there waiting for such a long time. Shoots him off to the corner turnbuckle, follows it up, close line. And look at him, he's talking to him. Another scoop, another slam, and a cover. Electrico breaks it up. Just couldn't do it. Young Jesse needs gear in the early part of his career, I'm sure. 10, 15 years from now, we're gonna be looking on this match saying how far he's come. Mm, if he makes it out. <laughs> if he makes it out of this match. Fine point out to Jesse needs gear now that he's only been here for a cup of coffee. Talking, talking down to Jesse needs gear is fine. Oh, two boots. Oh, mm. two boots, one man. Two boots is better than one any day of the week. Ashley and more double team action. No, He's Fang. Guys. Fang is distracting the referee. These guys are playing it smart. That's all I got to say, you know. When the stripes oh, aren't looking. He throws him over the top rope. That's an instant disqualification here in DCW. But that the referee didn't see it. That is not a disqualification because the ref had his back turned. Well, if the referee had seen it, the electric Fang would be out of here. 